Today, we're gonna be taking a look at Upleap. Is it actually a good Instagram growth service? Are you gonna get scammed if you use them? Is your Instagram account in danger? My name is Ethan and I've been doing professional Instagram marketing since 2014. And today we're gonna be taking a closer look at Upleap. Hey guys, so before I begin, I have reviewed over 25 different Instagram growth services. So if you wanna find out more about why these reviews matter, and if you wanna find the top rankings of the growth services that I have reviewed, and if you wanna understand the grading process that I use for these videos, be sure to check out ascendviral.com slash grades. Also, I have a nearly three hour, completely free Instagram marketing course that's available on YouTube. You can find it in the link in the description, or you can go to ascendviral.com slash course to find all the material associated with that course. Did I mention it's completely free? So please check it out if you're interested. It's a great resource if you're looking to gain followers on Instagram. Now, let's begin the review. All right, so here we are on upleap.com and we will be checking out Upleap. And Upleap says they'll get you real Instagram followers with targeted organic growth. Let's find out. Um, so they've been around since 2018. They've been around for a long time. They crush it with search engine optimization. I think if you type in like anything to do with Instagram growth, Instagram followers, they're way at the top of the search engine. Um, and their top package that we'll be looking at is $69 per month, I believe. Let me double check that. We're going with the $69 per month package because I'm not quite sure what's going on over here. And we'll get into that. So they will be rated on a five point grading system. And let me explain that to you right now. All growth services are ranked from zero to five stars. The grading rubric is as follows. Number one, is there a focus on the user's content? Good content is the key to growth. A service should assist in helping the user create better content or give coaching advice on how to improve their current content strategy. Some kind of content assistance earns a star. Number two, what type of growth is it? Does the growth method that the service use go against Instagram's terms of service, or is it a legitimate growth strategy? A legitimate ethical growth strategy earns a star. Number three, is it manual or is it a bot? Does the service incorporate some kind of AI, software, bot, or some kind of automation that goes against Instagram's terms of service? Or is it a manual service performed by hand on a real phone? Any kind of manual service, which is preferred, earns a star. Number four, is there a free trial or guarantee? Does the service offer some kind of free trial or some kind of satisfaction or growth guarantee? A free trial earns half a star and a satisfaction or growth guarantee earns half a star. Number five, who is running the company? Can the owner or the actual team information be easily found on the website? If the team or owner can be easily identified, they earn a star. All right, so let's talk about Upleap, all right? So I've been aware of Upleap for a long time. And what's kind of curious is that I remember about two years ago, so if you go on uh, the Wayback Internet Archive and you type in Upleap and you go back like two years, you're going to see a different service. So I'm not quite sure what happened here. But uh, yeah, if you go, they, they used to sell fake followers like two years ago. I remember like four years ago, they were very similar to how they look now. And then I'm guessing their service stopped working and then they just said, well, we all we already have all this great SEO presence. We already get all this traffic from Google. Our service doesn't work anymore, so let's just sell fake followers. So that's what they did. They sold fake followers. And recently, I guess, they're back with their service. And I try not to bring up a lot of external factors for any of these services that I review. Try not to do that because just so hard to verify things and I don't want to get into the weeds and whatnot, but that should, that that's kind of alarming for me that they used to sell fake followers. They thought that was okay. And now they're back to what they were doing, uh, you know, in their golden days. So no bots, no fake accounts. Well, they, they tend, they don't seem to have an issue with, uh, getting you fake followers. So 
if you've seen some of my other reviews, I talk about how some growth services, when they underperform and they don't gain clients a lot of followers, in order to keep the client subscribed, what they'll do is send them fake followers. So I'm not saying that Upleap is doing this, but you should keep that in the back of your head if you sign up with Upleap and all of a sudden you start seeing crazy growth that you didn't anticipate and some of the accounts don't look real, maybe you can put two to two together. Um, but that's just my, just my opinion, right? You've read the disclaimer. This is just my opinion. Um, but that, that is concerning. It is concerning that they use to sell fake followers and now all of a sudden they're pretending like it never happened. Like this is the exact site layout that they had four years ago from what I remember. And then they switched to a just typical fake follower site and now they're back to this. So who knows? Who knows? Um, typically, by the way, I should clarify, typically for all these services, I review the top plan at 239 per month. However, I went down to $69 per month in order to give them the highest score possible. Because if we, uh, well, let's, let's start from the top. I don't want to get carried away. So is there a focus on content? No, there's no focus on content. There's no, uh, there's nothing here that suggests that you should improve your content if you want the best results possible. There's no helping, there's no content suggestions, there's no profile optimizations, there's nothing like that. Which is a red flag. It's something that an organic growth service should be telling you that they're ultimately limited by the kind of content that you create. So keep that in mind. They don't seem to have an issue whether or not your content is good or not. Um, what type of growth is it? So on their standard plan, it seems that all they do is follow and follow which is why I chose this plan because that's their best chance. However, it's follow and follow automation, which is not good. Follow and follow is good. If you can do follow and follow on a real phone by hand, that's fantastic. However, if you do follow and follow with automation, tools, AI, software, whatever, apps, it's not good. So as far as what type of growth it is, I gave them half a star, I believe. Yes. Because at least it's follow and follow, I guess. Unless it's somewhat sustainable. However, it is automation. So is it manual or is it a bot? Zero stars there because it's clearly automation. Also, they have story liker and viewer, um, which is a huge red flag. That's the kind of stuff that gets your account banned. In case you're unfamiliar with what story liker and story viewer does, a lot of these services will try to get your account to watch like a hundred thousand stories a day and Instagram can see that, you know, why is this account watching a hundred thousand stories a day? And then they'll look into it and then they'll see that you're automating and there's your, there goes your account. Uh, so any, any service that does story viewing is a massive red flag. Uh, I have here on my sheet here of all the services of all the, of all the types of growth methods that I'm not a fan of, as you can see here, story viewing right there. Also fake followers. So they're, they're kind of a combination of some unsavory things. So not only are they automating follow and follow, which is bad, they're also automating story viewing on their top tier package, uh, which is just, you can't be doing that. You can't be doing that. If you care about your Instagram account, you just can't be automating. If you're doing follow and follow and it's highly targeted and you're doing it by phone, if you're doing it like with your hands on a real phone, great. That's actually good. Um, if you're doing it with software, bad. And from what I can tell, they're doing it with software. So that's not great. Um, next, is there a free trial or guarantee? There is a free trial, 10 day free trial, which is one of the better free trials out there. 10 day free trial is pretty good. Um, so I'm giving them a full star on uh, is there a free trial or guarantee? And if you look in the refund policy, they're they're kind of generous with the refund policy. They're a lot more generous than a lot of other companies. So they earn a full star in whether or not there's a free trial or a guarantee. So that brings their total to 1.5 stars out of five. Oh yeah, and then the last one is who's running the company? There's no owner. No one's taking responsibility for this. and. I mean, you shouldn't. If, if you're 
advertising that you're, you know, if you've advertised in the past that you've sold fake followers and you're doing automation now, yeah. You're basically asking yourself for a lawsuit, which is not good. Um, so of course, no owners are taking responsibility for this, which is again, is kind of the litmus test of whether or not a site is legitimate or not. Um, again, this is all just my opinion. Uh, yeah, so out of five stars, Upleap earns 1.5 out of five, which places them surprisingly enough, eighth, they're eighth out of the 31 growth services that I've reviewed, they've somehow cracked the top 10, which just speaks volume. V sorry, it just speaks volume. Is that the right words? Volumes? Speaks volumes. I had it right. I don't know. It's just amazing how many bad Instagram growth services are out there. There's a lot. If Upleap with 1.5 stars can sneak its way to number eight out of 31, then yeah. Eight through 31 is just not not great either uh so yeah that concludes my thoughts on upleap if you want to check them out you can go to upleap.com if you want to check out my organic instagram growth service you can check out ascendviral.com followers and if you want to check out the grading process and if you want to check out all of the reviews that i've done for all of these companies you can check out ascendviral.com grades thank you so much for watching and have a wonderful day